<clears throat> so, I haven't done a video on uh, anything to do with gang stalking lately. I tried to refocus my energy on more positive things. And that's what I kind of want to talk to you guys about in this video. Is if you're a targeted individual and, you know, you've witnessed, you know, gang stalking, uh, you know, happen to you or, you know, you've witnessed it in general and you realize that, you know, this is, this is really happening in the background, you know what I mean? Um, the worst thing that you can do is give all your energy to that, you know, because that's exactly what the devil wants to do. He wants to break you down mentally and physically and spiritually and soulfully until you're completely drained of your life force and you have no fight left in you and you become delusional because of the amount of stress that you're under and pressure that you're under which is bad for your mind it's bad for your mental health so it's not that you're mentally unstable and you're fucking schizophrenic like a lot of these agents try to say right it's just a matter of that you're allowing them to make you portray yourself in that manner now because they've got you to continuously react to that you know in an emotional manner so I made one video about it guy catches gang stalkers in act and gets framed in the act and gets framed and it went like fucking viral got like it's at 30,000 or 32,000 views right now and I get subs and, and views every day on that and new, new, yeah, new people on my channel every day from that one video, and that's been going on for months now. I've had another video um, get 30,000 overnight, but uh, <clears throat> the thing is, is you know, um, I didn't keep making videos about gang stalking or being a targeted individual or really getting too involved or drawing too much attention to myself about that topic. And if you don't know what gang stalking is, or, you know, the, the phrase or the term being a targeted individual, um, I'll leave a link in the description, you can check that out, you'll see a link that says gang stalking, you can look into it further if you decide to, I'm not talking about that in this video, I'm just highlighting a certain, something that I've been seeing lately is, uh, is a lot of targeted individuals are consuming themselves in the attacks, like, you're giving in to exactly what they want when they're initiating these attacks on you. And they're doing it in an organized, civilized manner that's only making you look like the uncredible source. You decredit yourself by reacting emotionally consistently all the time. And, you know, that's how you lose credibility. And, you know, people that are not aware of this type of, you know, thing that's happening, right? they're going to be logically turned away from it, you know what I mean, so that's why you got to operate, operate in a different way if you want to defeat this, you have to be civilized, organized, calm and collect at the same time, and we all have to come together and organize in a, in a, in a unit the same way as they do, the only reason why they went against us in it is because of attacks and numbers and they're organized and planned strategically, you know, very, very in depth, right, so if we were to operate in that manner, then we wouldn't be affected by any of their attacks. And actually, after I made that video, you'd think drawing all that attention to myself was a bad thing. It's not. It's, you know, it's, it really wasn't a bad thing at all. You'd think that, like, the gang stalking would get heavier. And uh, a lot of shit would start getting, you know, crazy. But that's not what happened at all. It was the opposite. They all scattered off, and, and, and all the attacks got deflected off of me because I draw I drew so much attention to it. They're cowards in the end of the day. The devil is a coward, you know what I mean? So um, you have to remember that. And the only way that, you, the only defense that there is against attacks like this, and if you are chosen um, and you are, you know, a targeted individual, uh, if you are not spiritually awake consciously yet, you're going to be suffering the worst and, and you're going to look the most mentally unstable even though that you're not this really is happening but you're going to not know how to deal with the attacks or defend yourself against these attacks because the only defense believe it or not 
is Jesus Christ. I know that, that you may not agree with that, but I'm just saying the only defense is God. And I've used it, I've used it and witnessed that this is real. And it, Jesus' name has an effect. And I've cast out demons in Jesus' name. And I've witnessed things happen in my life that I have no way of explaining other than watching it consistently happen for a long period of time to the point that I realize that it's not a coincidence anymore and there's an actual identifiable pattern and this shit is real. Shit got real, you know. It, my perception has been changed many times in life when I, I was very firm in what I believed and what I didn't believe, but I, I have, now I stay more open-minded and that's more wise to be that way, you know. I was very cautious about what I let in or what I considered, you know what I mean? I'm not very easily uh, influenced, I'm not very gullible, you know what I mean? But I'm, I'm intelligently open-minded, and that's what you guys need to be, is if you're a TI and you're a victim of gang stalking, you need to get on this frequency and on this tip, or else you stand absolutely no chance against these attacks. So that's my message right now to all the targeted individuals out there, all the TIs, anybody that's ever experienced gang stalking or witnessed it, you don't know what I'm even fucking talking about, there'll be a link, go ahead and check it out, uh, but that's all I'm going to talk about uh, for now about that, um, I just see there's a problem with this and everybody's consuming themselves and using their energy in a wrong way, when this could be directed in, in, in a correct way and organized in a proper manner where we can actually come up on top, financially, you know, spiritually, physically, you know, and uh, this is a spiritual battle. That's what most uh, TIs are not aware of, and some of them don't believe or accept in the God or spirituality. And, you know, it's unfortunate for them. They have absolutely no chance against this. They're going to be completely devoured and, and, and destroyed by, by, by those attacks. You know, God is the only protection in, 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 in reality, you know? Yeah, so... <sighs> crazy stuff, you know what I mean, make sure, you know, you like the video, share this video, tag a, a targeted individual, share this in, in gang stalking, you know, type groups and stuff like that, because I feel like this is, everybody's lacking in this consciousness, and they're not, they're getting so caught up into the trickery, the devil, that they're not seeing what's happening to them, and they're playing into it, and it's destroying them, and it's destroying all of our credibility. And it's a giving them the upper hand. So that can't, I can't allow that. You know what I mean? So neither can you. You know what I'm saying? So in the end of the day, you got to get organized, calm, collect. God brings clarity, you know. So know that. Quite resilient. Share this video.